Pokemon fusions are fun because not only can you make insanely powerful Pokemon by fusing them together, but you can also create unique and sometimes brand new typing combinations. Today, my friend Pat and I have six rounds of random starters that have been turned into Pokemon fusions, but we can't see them. Our opponent will reveal our starters to us by only telling us what they are weak to, but we can't look anything up. And if we ever mess up and forget a weakness or give a wrong one, the other player is allowed to hinder one of our Pokemon fusions on our team, like giving only three moves, no held items, etc. And after six rounds of building our best Pokemon fusion team that we can, we battle each other. Pat, welcome back to fusions, baby. Well, what were you doing there? You getting a little dance? I was idling. I was idling. Since you're idling, you can go first, Pat. Okay, let's go. <laughs> The walking NPC, dude. Oh, what the hell? I haven't seen some of these actually. Okay, this is pretty sick. I don't even know what this is. I'm trying to like take a closer look at it. I have to say all the weaknesses. All the weaknesses for all three Pokemon. And if the one that I pick is wrong, I can hinder one of your Pokemon in the future. Oh, but if only if the one you pick is wrong. That makes things a little easier for me. This is perfect because it has one weakness and I know it does. Fairy. Okay, well then that's Ghost Dark. You don't know. <laughs> yeah, the one <laughs> typing that had no weaknesses. That was great. Granted a weakness in Gen 6 with fairy types. You don't know, I didn't say that. So your second one, ghost, fire, rock, dark. <laughs> it's gonna have a stroke. Flying, are you paying attention? Yeah. I think that's it. Even if it's not, that sounds way too many weaknesses for me. Ghost Dark's already looking really good. I'm pretty sure I'm going with Ghost Dark. So your last one, Icing. It's, it's weak to ice. Come on, this thing is not good. Well, I mean, it's really good actually, Dylan. You should definitely pick it. My man says it's not good, but it only has two weaknesses in it. It's fighting and ice? A uh, bug. I think it has three. I'm gonna go ahead and just lock in Ghost Dark. I'm pretty sure that's what that's gotta be, so. I'm glad you picked that one because I probably got one of them wrong. So yeah, so you got yourself a Poltegeist and Zoroa. Off the jump, can't go wrong with a Pokemon with only one weakness and having Illusion to hopefully set up. We got Nasty Plot, will o -Wisp, Dark Pulse, and Flamethrower. We have officially banned Shell Smash because it's a little too broken in these because with Illusion, you get one free Shell Smash off. You just kind of sweep. But uh, still, Nasty Plot on an Illusion, thinking that some other Pokemon is out on the field. Yorkshire T is a great first pick for us. Okay, that's what I thought it was, baby. I think there's only two in the whole Fusion pack that is Ghost Dark. That's a great start. What were the other two? So I, I'm just curious if you were wrong. We had Beedrill and Gengar, and then we had Regirock and Rillaboom. Oh, I... Uh... <laughs> What the hell's wrong with me? I think it is only those three. I'm pretty sure. Okay, okay, good. Because I I was really racking my brain with that one. Let's go look at yours. Ooh, okay. Oh my God, this guy's jaw is broken. Go see a doctor, brother. Oh, he's so happy though. He's on painkillers. He doesn't feel it right now, but it's really gonna hurt later. Oh, I hope you choose this one right here. It's so <laughs> freaking cool. Oh, I really don't want you to have this one. No, don't you even look at me. You stay away. Your first Pokemon is weak to water, Steve and rock. Probably maybe like, ooh, rock flying maybe? Your next Pokemon is weak to ground, bug, fighting, and fairy. I don't know if that's too bad. Like there's four weaknesses, but there's a huge amount of moves for all of those different types. It's always interesting to do a video where it's also challenging for the YouTuber, but your last one is weak to water, ground, rock, dark, ghost. There's a lot going on there. Dark and ghost. So that could be a ghost type. Instead of water and ground, so I'm thinking it might be like maybe fire. We got lots of places to go, so I'll take the the one on the left, because I believe that had three. Okay, you have um, a Heracross and a Tyranitar. Pretty good first round. It's a choice scarf because it's a Moxie user. Pretty strong, pretty fantastic. It has insane coverage. This thing is just gonna come in, hit really hard, and it can also kind of save me if I need to in certain situations, because it's gonna outspeed most stuff, I would imagine, and I can start sweeping with Moxie, which is be amazing. Ooh. Pretty dang good. Uh, the last one was actually Blaziken and Necrozma. Really happy you didn't get that. And your middle one was a uh, a beautiful Raichu and Absol, so electric and dark. Yeah, this seems, seems pretty, but you know, not, not as good. How dare you, he's adorable. I'm sorry, buddy, maybe next time. Before our next fusion, this video is brought to you by Summoner's War and their celebration of their 10 year anniversary. A turn-based RPG where you collect monsters and form your teams with over 1,600 monsters 
and nearly infinite customization is available. And for everyone watching this video, I mean, it is obvious you love collecting monsters. Whether you've never played the game or you play this game every day already, there's no better time to try out Summoner's War than during their 10 year anniversary. Players can expect 10 types of monster skins for free, access to a new progression and infinite shop, a new user event for skill level ups, four different four star monsters, and even a five star monster, two brand new monsters, a mystical scroll, 10 plus one event, and you get 200 free 10 year special scrolls and a five star wish monster pickup. This is a first ever, never done before. The game is free to try out, so why not give it a shot? It's available on Google Play, the App Store, and even on Steam. So download right now by clicking my link in the description or the pinned comment to get all those awesome bonuses for the 10 year anniversary and try it out free today. So next selection is, oh my God, this middle thing is insane. And it also makes so much sense too. Is Dusty on the screen? No, Dusty's not allowed anymore. Dusty's been put in jail. He didn't deserve it. He didn't ask to be created. Yep. Your first Pokemon on the left here, Dylan. Ground, Dragon, and Rock. Ground, Dragon, and Rock. So, Fire Dragon. Whenever Dragon has a weakness or it's weak to Dragon, you know it's Dragon. So that's a clear giveaway. But then Rock and Ground has to be Fire because water would be neutral because of the Dragon. So, okay, Fire, Dragon, okay. And then in the middle, this guy's very, very cool. The middle one is weak to Rock, Steel, Water. So it's just another Bug Rock type. I mean, it might be. It might, might be something else. I don't know. It could be anything, really. Uh, the last one is not on the dock. So I'm imagining what this type is. Oh, oh, okay. It does have one weakness and it is dark. Okay, so that has to be ghost normal. Um, but you said Dusty's not on the screen, so it's not Dusty, so I don't really want it. Give me the um the bug rock type because it's only three weaknesses. I can try to see who's got the better bug rock type and you said it was really cool, so I want it. It's this fusion between Kabutops and Scyther and it's just like blades everywhere. It's crazy. Oh, I, I haven't even seen that one yet. Oh, he looks sick. This is my first time ever seeing this Pokemon, so I named him new student Kabutops and a Scyther. Bug and Rock is a very, very good typing. Very few weaknesses. Also gets Technician, which is cool, but we have Knock Off, Stone Edge, Dual Wing Beat, and Bug Bite. Dual Wing Beat and Bug Bite both get the Technician boost. This Pokemon has great speed, great attack, and a great typing. Oh! Okay. Ooh, this one's gonna be tough. I don't know if I'm gonna get all these right. All right, your first Pokemon is weak to fire, rock, flying, fairy, and bugs. Solid five. That's a weird collection there. I know. It's a really weird typing, too. Grass bug. Yeah. Good luck. That's not it, but okay. This next one, I think I'm right on this. It is uh, only weak to ground and water. Maybe fire steel. Ooh, that sounds good. And your last Pokemon is weak to flying, psychic, fairy, and ghost. Flying, psychic, fairy, and ghost. They're all very good offensive typings. Like you can get hit with those pretty super effectively, pretty easy. Pretty common typings, yep. I don't like the sound of the first one because it's five. I'll go with the middle. You're gonna go with the middle. This is a Arcanine and Mamoswine. It is fire and ground type. My boy, my sweet, sweet boy. Again, another fantastic round. We have my boy, of course. I love Arcanine. It's wonderful. It is Hobbs. It is a Mamoswine Arcanine fusion with choice band, so it hits so hard. It has Intimidate, which is one of the best abilities in the game. And we have Extreme Speed, Earthquake, Icicle Crash, and Flare Blitz, which I think is coverage for literally every single human being on the planet. This has coverage for 7 billion different people. This actually looks like a paradox, like past form of Arcanine. No one has ever chosen it in any of these videos that I've been in before, so I'm, I'm happy. I bet this video gets 20,000 likes right now because he finally got picked. I think there's a pretty good chance that we'll get 20,000 likes right now. Well, let's have a look and see what you got here. You got, oh my goodness, great damn. The the quality, it's, it's, it's like all all over the place. Oh, it's good and bad and ugly. So we have flying, poison, fire, steel, and rock for the left Pokemon here. It's a grass type. No. Oh, grass and what? No. Your second Pokemon, fire, fighting, and ground. I mean, the only thing I can think of is steel. That's literally all of steel weaknesses, right? Maybe. I mean, it's it's pretty cool. I could give you that one for free. It's pretty sick. Why did you sell it? Hey, Bader. Hey, Bader, this Pokemon's pretty cool. Dude! 
Dragon and Fairy is this last Pokemon's only weaknesses. Ah, uh, Dragon Dark, maybe? No, because then you're weak to fighting. Um, give me the Dragon Fairy weakness one. Okay, sure. It's um, <laughs> it's kind of goofy looking. It's Volcanion and Rayquaza, which is amazing, by the way. As goofy as this guy may be, Dragon and Water, very few weaknesses. Volcanion and Rayquaza, an excellent pick for us. Now, I built him specially when I typically build physically just to add a little bit more diversity to the team. Plus, I mean, Steam Eruption, Draco Meteor, Flamethrower are all excellent moves. Covers a lot of damage. And then I gave him E-Speed just in case I need to. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah, dude. Okay, I'll take him. All of what type of weaknesses is like nullified by Dragon. Technically, Patch. Freeze dry. Ice type. I don't care. Next round for Patterns. Oh, I hope you pick this so bad. Oh, I'm going to get the typing wrong. It's brand new and I've never seen it before. It looks so cool. All right. Your first Pokemon is weak to fighting fairy and flying. Oh, the three F's. You cannot forget about the three F's, man. Did you get F's in school? We don't have letter grades. Well, that's just weird. Says who, Dylan? <laughs> The American. I'm sorry the British school isn't American enough for you. No, honestly, I wish we had your schools. I love that we have to go to college to relearn what we just learned for two years and pay $20,000 for it. Sick. Brooks is editing this, holding his degree like, yep, it was awesome. Your next Pokemon. Dark, ghost, water, grass, Ice and bug. Jesus, that's all over the place. And your last Pokemon is weak to flying and rock. Oh, that's it? Yeah, I, I expected it to have a lot more. Flying and rock aren't super common offensively, so yeah, let's go with those. I'll go with the last one. You got a Venusaur and Ninetales. That is Grass Fire. It might not be the strongest Pokemon in the world, but it's got Life Orb. It's got itself a Solar Beam, Fire Blast, Will-O-Wisp, and Sludge Bomb. We have the Life Orb so we can change up the moves that we're using. Oh, and Grass Fire. Pretty good typing. Pretty solid. Covers a ton of stuff. I remember that. I was in the video where that was made. I was there when it was born. Great Pokemon. You didn't get the new lad, which was over here, which was a Verizion and Houndoom. We had Slowking and Flygon in the middle. Does ground or is this bug? No. Okay, then I was right. Now, let's have a look and see what you got. Oh my god. Whoa. <laughs> There's a lot. There's a lot to take in here. That's what my wife says. Never said that before in her life. Your first uh, Pokemon is week two. Groudon. Ground. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> your first one going to speak to ground and rock and electric and Groudon. And Groudon. Can't forget about Groudon. Is Groudon on your screen? Nope. Just on the mind. I just think about Groudon regularly. Their second one, I believe, is week two. Water, rock, and ground and fighting. And then I have never seen this little guy before in my life, but he is very, very sweet. He's very cool. He's very cute. I love your little innuendos. It's like, okay, okay, maybe I picked that one. Maybe, or maybe little hints like, oh, this one's so cool. You should totally pick this. Electric ground psychic. Ooh, so it's a cool little lad and he doesn't have a lot of weaknesses. Yeah, give me that one. Go ahead. I would love a water type if it is a water type. It's a cool guy. You have yourself Needle King Politoed. Oh, it's a new one. I'm cool with that. I'm not gonna lie. This is just me when I wake up on a Monday morning ready to record. We have the Politoed and the Nidoking King Fusion with sheer force giving us a 30% boost to all of our damage, which is amazing. We named him 20k subs because we're going to gain 20k subs from this video. Thank you guys so much for supporting. We got Scald, Ice Beam, Earth Power, and Sludge Bomb, and we just have him as a choice scarf to, you know, outspeed everything and deal a lot of damage. Let's see your fourth round, Pat. There is no way. Sounds like it's a good day to be, to be a pet fan. There's no freaking way. Hey, dude. Okay. Your first Pokemon left to right. I just realized it's raising the bar. Welcome to the new singular. We're raising the bar. Dark, water, rock, ghost, and ground. Jesus, that's so many. But it could be so good, though. So I, I shan't I shan't judge. Your next Pokemon is we to fire. Ghost, dark, and ground. Maybe a little psychic going on here. And your last Pokemon is weak to ice, dragon, and fairy. All right, well, that's a dragon. No. Yeah, and you said it was big. Okay, it's a big dragon. It is a big dragon fusion. I'm mad gamer right now. I'm taking that one. This is so funny that this happened. You got ground. Groudon and Tortenager. That is so, you literally go, this thing is weak to Groudon, and then he's on the stream. And now we get the big boy, the biggest man. And oh yeah, the sun is here and it's shining so bright. I have drought, I have heat rock. It's gonna be a bright sunshiny day. Heat crash, will -O stealth rocks, precipice blades. I mean, what do you do, what do you do, big man? What do you do, big man? Groudon. Okay, all right, let's see. So your round five picks are looking, ooh, oh, oh, oh. 
Oh. It's a lot of uh, emotions in one little reaction. There's a lot going on here. A lot going on. Good things, good things. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Only good things. I think your first Pokemon is only weak to fairy and bug. Some kind of dark type, I'd assume. Like dark fire, maybe? Every time I write ground, I put Groudon instead now. What's wrong with you, dude? <laughs> the second Pokemon is weak to Groudon, Fighting, and Electric. Groudon. What is weak to ground and electric? Yeah, yeah, like the water poison again. No, because fighting. Water steel? I, uh, well, I can't, I, well, I'm not going to tell you. I think it's water steel. I'm pretty sure that's water steel. Your last Pokemon is weak to fire, flying, and rock. That one's hard because it's like it could be a grass type. <sighs> it could be bug again. It's the, it's the late game. I got to make sure my team is well diverse. Give me water steel, man. I, I, I'm i going to have a stroke. It is water steel. You had a Raquinid Metagross, which is insanely good. Although this is not the Pokemon I wanted, a Raquinid Metagross is so freaking good. It is a great typing. We gave him substitute because great special defense, great physical defense, and leftovers. It's going to do a lot of damage as well because we got Liquidation, Knockoff, and Earthquake. Although I didn't need another water type because we have Politoed and Rayquaza, still really good. All right, well, I'm just going to spam electric type moves, I guess. Honestly, it's all you got to do, dude, apparently. Okay, let's See, you're round five. God, please don't pick this. Why well, I hear there's something good in there. I'm gonna be honest. Yeah, you I, I hope you pick. Never mind. I'm not gonna say anything. All right, your first Pokemon is weak to ground, water, rock, and fighting. I already have a lot of Pokemon that are weak to those types. Maybe I avoid that. Maybe, maybe not. Your next Pokemon is weak to fire, rock, flying, ghost, dark, and bug. Six? What is this? A Tyranitar? Might as well be, honestly. It does have a lot of weaknesses. Your last Pokemon is is weak to water and ground. You know what? I'm going to put my belief in a Pokemon that has more weaknesses. Don't smile at me. What are you smiling for? The six weaknesses, the middle one. You are going to be happy because you got a Buzzwall Lugia that is bug psychic. This is just a big amount. This is a great round. This is such a good round. I have a bug psychic type, which may have a lot of weaknesses, but I do have leftovers. I have beast boost to increase my attack if I knock something out. And I have so much recovery on this. I have a leech life drain punch to make sure I never die. And then we have a little bit of coverage from Lugia in the back as well, just to be nice. But this thing is so bulky. It's it's just going to be amazing. All right, so your final... <laughs> oh my God. Wow, there's a lot going on here. This is pretty sick though. I'm going to watch this video back and do a shot every time I hear there's a lot going on here. You know, drink safely, of course. I want you to be uh, <laughs> healthy and happy, but you know, enjoy yourself. All right, so your first Pokemon is weak to electric, rock, water, and steel. Okay, finally, definitely not a water type. I have three right now. I definitely don't want another one. All right, so your second Pokemon is weak to Groudon, poison, water, and rock. Groudon... I I mean, weak to Groudon scary, because guess what? You have a Groudon. So that is something I really got to take into consideration. Your last Pokemon is weak to Fighting, Water, Groudon, and Rock. Groudon. All these Groudon weaknesses, man. And they're all weak to Water, which means great that none of these are a Water type. So that's that's good. I'm going to hope that first one is a Flying, and I'm going to grab that one. Actually, I'll tell you your other two first. The middle one was Fire Fairy. It was the Ho-Oh Magina fusion. That would have been so good! The one on the right was just Incineroar's regular typing, but it's Incineroar on Darkrai. Oh, it's just him on all fours right? You know, he's, he's standing up. It's Darkrai and Incineroar, and he's standing up. Oh, there's two Incineroar fusions. That's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. The last one on the left is Swoobat and Tyranitar. And last but not least, this guy's been a fan favorite. He's been popping up left and right. We have Blank and Clean. Good old Kingdom Hearts reference. Simple and clean. We have the Tyranitar and Swoobat with Simple. He's not done as much damage as the potential that he has. We have Dragon Dance to get plus two in attack and speed. Dual Wing Beat, Rock Slide, and Knock Off. Great moves and a great ability. And Heavy Duty Boost to not get any damage if he does do Stealth Rock. But overall, a really good team. Patters, good luck. Oh, uh, that's still good. That's still good. I actually would prefer the Magirna. I mean, that's just a really good mythical legendary fusion. But still, hey, I'll take a Swoobat and I'll take a Titar. Oh, I might miss one. I did. I missed one. Dylan, I missed Ice. Wait, let me see if I can guess it. Okay, so it's got to be the rock weakness, right? I missed a weakness, Dylan. I missed Ice. And you said, let me guess. It has to be a rock weakness. <laughs> So I can hinder one of your Pokemon, unless I mess up here too. Let's see your final round first. Oh, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. You're so happy to see me. Hi. Your first Pokemon is weak to Dragon, Fairy, Rock, Flying, and Ice. Okay, it's definitely a dragon. Ooh, fuck dragon. Uh, your next one is so easy. I don't got to look up anything. I know it's right. It's weak to grass. Oh, wall ground. Mm, perhaps. Perhaps. And your last Pokemon. Yeah, you're weak to fire and ground. Well, I don't actually have that many fire and ground weaknesses. I don't think right now. On the off chance that it's not just fire and ground, I'm going to pick the last one and see if you got it wrong. I just checked and I was right. It is only fire and ground, but you got fairy steel, excavalier, and grimsnarl. And our final Pokemon to bring everything together, a fairy steel 
steel type, very good. We have light clay, which is absolutely fantastic because I have prankster light screen and reflect. I'm gonna be so annoying. I don't think he's bringing Brick Break. No one brings Brick Break. Who brings Brick Break? I think it's gonna be fantastic. It's gonna be too super helpful for us. I can't even speak correctly. That's how good it's gonna be. All right, good luck in the battle, man. I'll see you in it. All right, let's go. Crowd on. Uh, all right, let's take a gander at his team. God, it's fat. His team is so thick. You got Grimstone Excavalier, which is undeniably thick. Crowd on. You have Buzzwall and Lugia, Tyranitar, Mammoth Swine, Venus. This is. I very fat team. Mine's very like, you know, balls of the wall offensive because we have, you know, Technician, Scyther, we have Sheer Force, Politoed, we have Rayquaza. So mine's more of like the attacking Mon and his is more of taking the hits. So on the lead, if I'm Patters, who do I lead with? I think maybe Grimmsnarl, but he doesn't get Spore or anything. So I'm actually going to lead the Politoed, I think, because I'm Choice Scarfed. I have a lot of coverage, Sheer Force. What's the plan, big man? Hmm. Maybe we just go tee -hee. Get some screen set up, go into Big Man, and then just reap havoc. Yeah, yeah, it sounds like a good idea. Oh, I'm sweating up today. I'm sweating it big time. Yo, I don't know how much I'm supposed to talk here. We'll see. All right, let's see what he does. Let's see what he does. Tee hee. Ah, I was right on the lead. Okay, so he does go for the Prankstermon on the jump. 20,000 subscribers. God, that's so many. All right, we got tee hee up at the front, although my moves aren't very good against you. No, I don't have stab earth power, but I do have sheer force because I'm water poison and you're fairy and steel. Okay, so I'm gonna, just, I'm going straight for the attack, earth power. I feel pretty confident just setting up a, we'll start with a light screen and we'll head up with a reflect. He's probably gonna stay in actually. He does set up a light screen. This should still decently hurt because he can't be vested because he's setting up screens. This should definitely hurt. That is not Hurting! I'm nice and protected. It doesn't have brick break. See? Earth power. Okay. I'm protected slightly from this. That did very little damage. Jesus Christ. That did absolutely nothing. Why can't I ever use this guy efficiently? And so he's definitely going to set up again. All right. Let's set for reflect now. I have these for so many turns. He's light claying. Yep. I just got to waste time at this point because he's definitely got light clay on there. Um, there's no lefties or anything, so I'm just going to get off much as, as much damage as I can for Teehee. There's so much potential of what we can do. Boom. Set up the reflect as well. Oh, feeling pretty good. What are you going to do? Just earth power me again? Just going to earth power me again. Okay, that's completely fine. I really don't mind that. Oh, I have a lot of potential coming up here. Okay, do I go into big man? Because uh, I'm resisted on that. He's probably going to switch here. Does he have a flying type? He does not. And this hurts decently a lot of his team. I'm predicting a switch here because I don't think he can do anything to me. And if I'm Patters, I feel like he might go Venusaur. That's going to big man, not bigger man. And let's get that sunset up. I feel like that's going to be very, very useful for us. And I can get a Stealth Rocks too, if I want to. It's not going to do much damage to me. He might switch out. Oh, he's so cool. It's one of my favorite. Yes. Come on. Venusaur, Venusaur, Venusaur. Big man. Ah, I got the read wrong. Dang it. Oh, I had the same idea, though, that he would go for Drought, but Venusaur Ninetales also gets Drought, so I thought that's what he's doing. He's running like little baby boy. All right, let's see what you got. New student. What is this going to do? Do I have a Fire-type move? Oh, God. I don't know what this does. Oh, it's the big man. <laughs> oh, it's the big man. Okay. All right, so we have Drought. We have Heat Crash. We have so much. I should outspeed. Could Shell Trap, I guess. I don't even know what that really does. I'm just going to go straight for the knockoff. Oh, knockoff. No, my Heat Rock. Oh, that does nothing. Okay, so that kind of sucks. But now we have Sun Up. I feel pretty good about having Sun Up, though. And Stealth Rocks. So there's a lot going on here. Heat Rock. Oh, okay. Well, the drought is already out now. So the good thing is it's not going to help him in the future. That also did no damage. When I say no damage, I genuinely mean that did nothing. The issue is I have a very clear ground weakness and we saw how much knockoff literally did. Obviously, physically, I'm not going to hurt this thing at all. Since we have sun up, I'm just going to heat crash. What are you going to do, Dylan? I have the sun. Oh, wait a minute. I'm not stab. It's not stab fire type move. But you know what? It's okay because I still get the sun. So it's basically stab and I'm, I'm a big boy. So I feel like I just go for the dual wing beat and just try to get as much damage off as I can. And <laughs> just... <laughs> <laughs> that is comical. He goes for heat crash. Okay. Okay. I live and it hurts him. So that's not bad. Dual wing beep. 
Till I can see Dylan's camera, he's laughing as well. It's really funny. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that damage, man. So heat crash. Um, You're not going to go for a dragon move this turn. You're not going to predict the switch because I'm already weak. Please tell me it's weak to... Oh, wait, does this say levitate? It's not levitate, does it? It's not levitate, right? Precipice blades? Yeah, yes. Bam. Oh. You did not go for a dragon type. Precipice... I can't believe he went for that. Okay, but the good thing is I definitely outspeed and I definitely kill here. He might predict this and go to his fairy type again. Oh, I'm feeling really good right now. Okay, he's probably gonna outspeed me now. So I could switch out into something. I feel like <sighs> switching out is a little risky. He might go for a war type move. The only issue with this uh, Groudon and Tordinator is the fact that he's so bulky. You have to do ice against him. And I only have one ice move on my entire team and that is Politoed. And Politoed is poison. So that precipitous ice play would have killed me. Honestly, I might just sack off. Oh, how how many turns of reflect do I have actually? I can check. Oh, we still have, okay, we have two turns of light screen still. I might just hold off for a second and just try and finish it off with the precipice blades. I can't do Pokemon! Are you kidding me? Oh, the miss! Oh, the miss is so big! The miss is really big. I mean, I saw the light screen up for a bit, but the loose is really big there. Oh, that hurts, man. He's feeling bad about that. That's a huge, that's tough. That's a tough one. 20k subs is back in. I don't even know if this kills with the light screen up, to be honest. I genuinely don't know. Yeah, okay, four times. Even with the live screen, thank God. I I mean, it's okay. I was probably gonna die, you know, pretty convincingly anyway. Do I live? Come on, with the light screen. No, I thought with the light screen I could live. Okay, okay, okay. That sucks. That Draco Meteor is really massive. He goes out to Apollo. Am I Am I even grass type? I forgot what type I am. I hope I'm grass type. Does this thing get chlorophyll for the sun? I actually don't know. He might get chlorophyll. I'm just going to fire off a solar beam here. Eventually, the sun's going to run out. I'm not going to have the sun anymore. Oh, I should have packed like earth power. That would have been really good. But I have life orb and a max special attack. So there's a good chance that this just kills. He does have chlorophyll. Um, I, can't, I couldn't remember if he gets it or not. There's no way he'd outspeed. Now, this is neutral. If he specs, I live. Ain't no, okay, so you're life orb. That's freeze, freeze. Okay, the reflect is gone. Come on, come on, solar beam. Okay, let's see how much damage this does. Is it gonna kill? I don't know, it might kill. I hope it does. That's why I have the life orb. Come on, 30% more damage, baby. Big damage, big damage. No, oh, it just doesn't kill. That's a little unfortunate. Okay, how much is that gonna, that's neutral, right? Okay, that's not too bad. So my reflect is gone now. I think I'm about to lose. Yeah, I think I'm about to lose Sun. So I'll just use one more solar beam to take out 20K subs. Sun is still out. So he's gonna chlorophyll solar beam again. I don't have really anything to just take this hit, you know? I need that Sun to go away. Yeah, I think I'm about to lose Sun. So I'll just use one more solar beam to take out 20K subs. I can, however, get my reflect and light screen back up again. I gotta start thinking of what my win con is at this point. I feel like win con is Swoobat and Tyranitar. I'm not locked into this, so I can always use Will-O-Wisp on something afterwards as well. Just to, just kind of shut it down. Woo! All right, there goes 20k subs. Yes. Okay. There's that. That's all I needed right there. Ah, oh, the sunlight. The sunlight's gone. Okay, that sucks. He does have a Stealth Rocks up, so I can't go into him. I didn't pack another Grass type move, so I don't know if he has anything that's weak to Grass. If this guy brought Sleep Powder, this is a problem. Show me your big boys. Show me your big boys, Dylan. Oh, this is gonna sweep me. I think I have to just go for the KO on this guy. He might switch to uh, Grim Snarl. He might not knowing that I have. I'm simple D Dance though. I don't think it's smart to even try and set up this. He does. Wow. Does he go to the Grim Snarl? This is really scary. I think I hard swap into Scarabon because I know he's gonna try and set up right now. And then I have Choice Scarf and I can Stone Edge next turn. No. He thought I was gonna set up. So I'll take that. That's good damage. I think he has the heavy duty boots on this too. So I don't think he has like scarf or anything. <gasps> Ooh, okay, we tank. Okay, we tank. Okay, okay. You know what? This is like the best case scenario. I think I have to stone edge here. And I'm feeling, no, he's, he's not scarfed. There's no way he's scarfed. He is any lands. 
and I'm dead. Dude, the only reason I think he'd be scarf because if I did it instead, I would have outsped. Oh, he lands. Bam, it's dead. It's dead. It's dead. It's dead. It's gone. Okay. And I have Moxie. And there's the Moxie. That's fine. That's crazy. I should have de danced. I didn't think he would switch. Okay. There it is. Just switch here, Patters. Just switch here. You don't want to go for the attack. You don't want to lose this. I know you have a Moxie boost right now. Show me what's in your mind. What? Okay. Oh, well, this resist on edge. If I could swap up moves right now, oh, you'd be so sad. All right. Well, I'm going to keep him in the back for later. He's definitely going to go for a water type move. I mean, I don't really have a good answer to that. Yeah. I'm just going to, I think I'm just going to sack off. Teehee. Yes. 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 Where's he go to? Teehee. Oh, and he can't prankster me. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. He can't prankster me because I'm a dark type. He has no idea. I don't imagine I live this. It's a pretty strong bond. It's got like water bubble liquidation. Nasty plot. Okay, I have to light screen. What? What? I thought he can't. I'm ghost dark. Is it because I'm illusion? Why can't he prankster me? All right, let's just do it. I have prankster though. So no matter what, I definitely go first. Okay, yeah, we get the light screen up. Okay, that's making me feel a little bit more safe. This is a scary mon though. You're doing it again? I'm so confused. So many things are happening. I thought he couldn't. I am plus four. What are you going to use? I thought he couldn't prankster me. I was like, yo, he's going to fail and not see it. He does switch. Who is this? Oh, that's a... I'm not going to do anything there. This is scary. I, I have the light screen, but he's plus four now. So this is pretty bad. Come on, Hobbs. You can do this. I love you, Arcanine. Yeah, I, I can't. There, okay, surely he knows by now. You won't die in one hit, right? Flamethrower. Oh, huge. That's perfect. That's totally fine. It's still big damage, but it's totally fine. And I outspeed you. You've already had a Scarf Mon. The Dark Pulse. Do we tank one? Do we tank one? Do we tank one? No! Oh my god. How, wait, how do you outspeed me? Yes! Let's go! The reverse sweep is here! How do you outspeed me? Oh! He's so lost. He is so lost. And he's gonna know that I'm scuffed, but I have to reveal this. I have to close combat or he's gonna kill me. He's gonna attack Stone Edge and probably kill. <laughs> Yo! No, he didn't! <laughs> yeah, we're gonna go for the CC. That should get. Oh my god. It's the fucking Zoroark. I misclicked though. I should have dark pulsed. And he's locked in. He's scarfed. It doesn't matter. He's scarfed. That's. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> I'm so dumb. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. It has a. Of course it has illusion. That's why it's so fast. That's his only chance. That is cr If I dark pulse, if I dark pulse, I guarantee one. Oh, I'm such an idiot. I can't believe this. And it's ghost dark, so it doesn't have any weaknesses. Now there's no guarantee because he he could come in, outspeed me, and I'm, 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 beep. I'm dead. I can't believe I just let that happen. I have to mega horn it. Okay, watch this read. Watch this read because he's stone edging. Damn, I feel like such a moron. Oh, now, now the actual wet comes out. He's stone edging. I go actually out to wet. <laughs> Oh, he mega horned. That's fine. Damn it. Okay, okay, this mon is important. I feel like I need to get this mon around. I'm gonna try and sub. Damn. Oh, I feel like such an idiot. I really do. I feel like a moron right now. Oh my God, dude. This is, I, I'm playing out my mind at the end besides that dark pulse mix click. Okay, the biggest guy. Sub is really annoying that you're doing that. <laughs> Patrick, what are you gonna do, buddy? I know you got multi-scale. We'll find out, we'll find out. I'm also super, super bulky. Like I am ridiculously, ludicrously bulky. I, he's not gonna switch out. I'm just gonna drain punch. Drain punch. Okay. Lugia's got insane speed. That is going to make me, f uh, it's going to fade. Knock off. No, my left, my leftovers, no. So he's not multi-scale, he's beast boost. All right, I knock off lefties. That's really good for me. Oh, I thought I was way more bulky than I actually am. He's going to withdraw too. He's going to go into the fucking, no. Oh, he's sacking. Oh, he's sacking. If he drain punch, that's fine. Because I, I brought out him for a rocky helmet. And I'm going to die anyway as a clean switch. So he doesn't get a heal. And he should drain punch here. Yep, there it is. 
Is he going to go into the illusion mon? Is he going to go into his regular mon? Yorkshire tea. There's that stupid, ugly creature. Stupid, ugly critter. Dark Pulse should kill. Light Screen is gone, but he can kill me, but he can't drain punch me. I don't know if I can tank a Dark Pulse, actually. I feel like I can't. He withdraws to his fairy type. Actually, I totally lived. Oh, you know what? I need to light screen. I need to light screen and reflect right now. Okay, that's decent damage. Ooh, okay, okay. Yeah, I need to light screen right now, I think. Okay, so you can prankster a dark type if it's not an attacking move. I actually didn't know that. Okay, that's fine. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. It's okay. We live, we live. We li Oh, we barely hang on there. Light screen and reflect going up towards the end game. I did this just in case he switched. Ah, uh, I did that just in case he switched there. He'll probably nasty plot this turn, I think. He didn't. He misses the willow. The willow miss. I don't think it matters though. No, he's just gonna kill me. Okay, that's fine. It's coming down to the wire, man. He got that light screen and reflect up. That's huge. I'm pretty sure I can tank a dark pulse now. I feel like Scaraborn is the solution here. Lowe's, who is this? Okay. Uh, but the question is, what do I click? If he CCs, did he CC? If he CCs, this is such a good play. There's no way he makes that crazy of a read, though. I think he just mega horns here. He does switch. Okay, I did go for the crunch. That's the neutral play here. Let's see. Okay, with Stealth Rock's damage, two crunches might kill. He crunches. Okay, that's fine. Not enough damage, and I can definitely substitute. I don't know. I don't know how much damage you can do this. Ah, uh, oh, I don't know. I don't know. It's going to be close. I think I have to swap. I think this is such a risk. I think I have 25%. I should have, I should have looked. I should have looked. I should have looked. I should have actually counted. Yeah, I think this is the correct play. I have to keep this scoffer around. Oh, this is really coming down to you, man. Yes, I have enough. I have enough. That's huge. That is so huge because he can't drain punch me now. He goes for the sub. Wow. Because I would definitely would have broken the sub. Oh, maybe I wouldn't have broken the sub, actually. Okay, so we get a little bit of health back here. Not much. I'm glad that you do drain from subs, though. Come on, come on, come on. We're getting close to the end here. We're getting close to the end. What do you heal? You actually get that? Okay, so liquidation. He's going to eat this because reflect is up. That's not really eating it, honestly. I'll take that. Oh, I just need my scarf around. I just need my scarf around. We got a little bit of health back there. Eat liquidations. I have the reflect up, though. I have the reflects. It doesn't do too much. This is where it comes into the reads. It's just pure reads at this point. Because if he drain punches and I go to a ghost type, I'm good. I have to account for the switch, I think. Leech life. And I think I'll take this. Oh, man. Okay, 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 okay. I, dude, it's it's crazy lucky reads. I, I'm reading like a book right now. Liquidation? I'm pretty sure I live now. I think I live. Come on. Yeah, we live on seven. Oh, my God. This battle's insane. Okay, leech life kills. And then my scoffer, my scoffer in the back will save the day. It's going to be so close, dude. It's going to be so freaking close. And Leech Life is not super effective, but it's definitely going to hurt me. He's going to get away his choice card. It's all down to if he can miss. See you later, bud. I'm pretty sure. I got I got the beast boost. It doesn't matter. It's, it's not a speed boost. It's okay. It's an attack boost. There's the beast boost, too. Oh, I didn't think about that in the moment because I knew he wasn't. The light screen's off, but it doesn't matter because he's going to outspeed. He's Lugia speed. But now I think that we can wrap things up here because he's going to take Stealth Rock's damage. I outspeed? I didn't know that. He has to kill me. And then I come in with my scoffer and then I kill. And then I kill him until he's dead. I beat him to death. Dude, if he misses Stone Edge, I win. It's coming down to the 1v1. I have to land a hit. Miss! Oh, he, it's, it lands. I'm dead. Yes! Oh, yes, yes, yes. There it goes. Woo! Yeah, baby. That was so close, though. That was such a good game. I should have clicked. Oh my god, I threw so hard. I didn't click Dark Pulse earlier in the game and I clicked Flamethrower. <laughs> I mean, listen, that was such a good game though. You, uh, you that was got such me. a good you battle. You got me good with the illusion. Uh, such a good game, man. It really was. You know what? Groudon.